Yo, what is going on guys? Horcrux here. Welcome back to the channel. So I have a very special video for you guys today. I got to duel a member of the ESO stream team. You guys may know him. He's a phenomenal mag DK, painting the axe. Um, I was doing my, during my stream, you know, doing my 1VX thing. Chrom70, uh, who did sponsor this uh, million dollar duel, by the way. Yeah, he messaged me like, hey, you know, Axe is logging on. Uh, do you want to duel? I said, sure. So I hopped off. Uh, I took my open world build. I took it into Stormhaven. Did some duels. Uh, we did a best two out of three. I will let the clips play. I'll have my perspective. And then after my perspective, I have his perspective as well. So let me know what you guys think. Also, patrons, thank you so much. Thank you for all the very generous donations yesterday on stream. I have enough to get a new mic, so I don't have to use this headset anymore. And thank you so much for all the new YouTube members. Welcome to the channel. Let's roll the videos, guys. Okay, guys, so uh, apparently what happened is I was lis listening to some music on stream. Of course, this is the time I tuned over to Pandora. And uh, I can't monetize this video with the sound in the background. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to just shoutcast over top of it uh, during the duel. I noticed my green screen. I did fix my camera, but uh, I actually changed times of day. I was actually using the natural light from daytime to help my green screen here. But yeah, uh, it's faded. Uh, ignore that. So chat baited me into this duel. Um, I was not ready for this. Uh, luckily I had Zons on because what I did was I just took uh, whatever open world build I had on. I just uh, ran up in here and I was bitching on stream. I'm like, man, accident dueling build. I don't get my ass packed up. So I was pretty worried about that. But luckily I did have Zons on. So that did kind of make this pretty even. So just a battle of the DK wits back and forth, right? Um, one huge advantage I did have in this fight is that I was using uh, Ash Cloud. Ash Cloud is probably what made me win this fight, uh, to be honest. Of course, Zons did help uh, quite substantially, right? But um, I think Ash Cloud was the deciding factor because that is a lot of dot damage going on. And if you're going to fight a DK with another DK, you kind of have to stand in their Ash Cloud. There's really not much you can do. So this entire time, I'm just keeping up the pressure. I know not to let him get to his front bar because I'm guessing he's rocking flame, Flames of Oblivion and Molten Whip combo. So I did just completely out-pressure him. Uh, ignore my smug little face, right? This is the first time I've dueled in quite a while. So just uh, <laughs> just kind of ignore that. Um, I didn't dump my ulti at the beginning because I didn't know I had to. But uh, I don't think it would matter regardless, even if I did. So we will do a best two out of three. At first five was a pretty one-sided. Uh, I don't think he was kind of mentally prepared for this because I've been PVPing all day. This is his first time on stream. Uh, he's doing an Iron uh, Man challenge. So uh, he changed up his build uh, to kind of readjust himself. And, and this battle was uh, pretty even. So he puts on uh, Cinderstorm, uh, not Eruption. Cinderstorm is a good heal. But I believe he took off Rapid Regen, which was a huge mistake. Uh, he needed to keep rapid regen on and swap his potion. Um, I'm, I, I think he's running tripods. He should have swapped it to uh, Alliance Spell Drop Pots and had rapid regen and Cinderstorm. I don't think I've been able to kill him. So, um, this whole fight, I'm just trying to uh, keep my talons up. Um, he does have an advantage by running Ellie Drain. Um, of course, this is my open world build. There's no need for me to run Ellie Drain. So, that's a 10% damage swing plus a huge resource swing in his favor. Uh, but I have talons, which means I can stay on the aggressive a lot because I can just imminently power lash. Unless he rolls out of these talons or the fossilize, I can just endlessly power lash with no hope of him turning on me. Now, I almost lose here, actually, because right here, right, right there, you can see me trigger the fossilize. But he gets the leap off. Like, it, it stops my uh, animation for the fossilize. So I could have potentially died there. Uh, again, talons, power lash, power lash. I'm throwing leaps off cooldown just to keep my sustain up and the pressure on him because he has to sit on his back bar this whole time. Uh, this is a, a pretty devastating setup. I mean, it really is. It, it, it's hard to come back from on DK once you get on the back foot. It's really hard to recover. Um, he actually does recover with, uh, right after this Zons. I, was, I thought he was going to die right here, uh, to be honest. Um, but he didn't. And if he had a leap right here, I think he was like a couple seconds off of a leap. I could have potentially died as well. I mean, I had Iron Blood up, but um, yeah. So I I really enjoyed this fight. Uh, kudos to him. It was really fun. So what I decided to do here, um, I laid off the pressure just to give him some breathing room because I, I can't kill him if he's on this back bar. I gotta go, let him go offensive at some point. Um, but uh, regardless, uh, this was a really good fight. Uh, I appreciate the duel with him. I appreciate Chrom from sponsoring this duel for Million Gold. That's from Golot to helping builds. And we got a big dick 4k uh, hit there. So uh, even through block. 
Uh, so that's me shoutcasting this. I will leave uh, his perspective at the end of this. I will not be shoutcasting that. I'll just uh, let it play out. But uh, thank you guys uh, so much for subbing to the channel. And uh, catch you all in the next one, maybe. Uh, also, become a YouTube community member. It's pretty awesome. As well as Patreon if you want to support my uh, crippling addiction to sticky notes. So, anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching this video. And please stick around to the end. Uh, it's uh, pretty good. So, peace, guys. What's going on? Um, we're doing a duel for a 1 million gold. Krom sponsoring it. He wants me to duel another Magni K. 50k on you, dude? Fucking 50k? It's cheap. Why'd you bet so low on me? Who am I fighting? But we're doing this duel first. Krom asked if I could do this. I'm not even warmed up, but whatever. GG. Fuck me. I don't know why fucking um my CC breaks not going very well right there. I gotta drop my fucking corrosive. I think he started with ult though, honestly. I need to change this. I forgot I was wanting to do Cinder Storm instead of fucking regen. That was not a good display from my part, honestly. This guy's pretty good. Dude, I don't know why I keep staff bashing, dude. Dude, it's so clunky right now on my part. Oh, GG. Good fight, good fight. Fuck's RG? Yeah, fuck's RG. Good fight. Give him a million gold, he wins. Honestly, dude. I was not in the win that. Well, you lost 50k. Uh, you lost 50k, Morpheus. I'm sorry, dude. Hey, what's up, Kagers? How you doing?